Hello everyone, with the Jamaica here. Welcome to this updated video on the weather across Jamaica. It is Thursday morning, January 5th, 2023. Let's jump right into it. So we can see that on the significant feature map, we have some lines right here that represent a trough. And when we look back at the satellite images, we can see a lot of cloud cover, lots of showers and thunderstorms that is affecting portions of the Dominican Republic at this time, especially south of the Dominican Republic. We can see a lot of thunder clouds and we can see a lot of white sparkling dots that represent some amount of lightning flashes. And all of this is expected to push its way to the west, affecting portions of Jamaica on Friday. Let's look at what's happening this morning, this Thursday morning across Jamaica. We can see a lot of clouds coming in from the east northeast, affecting portions of St. Mary, St. Anne, Trelawney, St. James, and Hanover, with some amount of overcast skies, if not some amount of rainfall. And if we actually take a look at the Cuban Doppler radar images, we can see a lot of greens and yellows that represent that rainfall. So we have greens that represent moderate rainfall, and the yellows that represent strong rainfall. In the afternoon, however, we can see some of these blues are expected to make it to across portions of central and western Jamaica. So this is showing 4 p.m. on Thursday. That's on the Euro model. And the GFS is showing something similar. So all of that rain is expected to move its way towards western and central parishes. Let's talk about tomorrow, however. This is 4 p.m. tomorrow. Look at all of these blues that represent rainfall, even getting into some of the greens and yellows that represent um, high amounts of rainfall. That's on the Euro, that's 4 a.m. The GFS is showing rainfall, but not as robust as the Euro model, but there's still rainfall. We know that when we have consensus like this, the chances of it actually raining are much higher. Look at this, 6 a.m. We still have a lot of blues across Jamaica and even spilling into portions of um, central and western Jamaica during the afternoon. So this is 3 p.m. seeing a lot of blues across portions of central parishes and western Jamaica as well. And if we actually take a look at the accumulated precipitation forecast, the Euro model is showing um, a lot of accumulated rainfall. This is all of the rainfall that's expected from now up until this is 3Z on Saturday, from now up until 10 p.m. on Friday. And we can see the concentration of the rainfall anywhere from 0 0.05 of an inch of rainfall all the way up to an inch of rainfall, especially across portions of eastern Jamaica. And the GFS agrees with where the rainfall is expected, eastern and western Jamaica, but not so robust on the, the, the GFS model as how it is on the Euro model. So it makes sense that our workers here with the Jamaica made a post this morning in Jamaican Creole. It says them cloudy and Espanola go drop some rain on Jamaica on Friday. So that trough is gonna do a number on Jamaica on Friday. So get yourself ready for that. Before we go, we're going to show you what the Climate Prediction Center has been stating recently. They made a post on Tuesday stating that for January 11th to January 17th, we can see some amount of above average rainfall across portions of the Central Caribbean. Where is that? That includes portions of Eastern Cuba, the Bahamas, portions of Hispaniola and Jamaica. So get yourself ready for some amount of rainfall during that time. Alright, so that's it for today. Thanks for watching.